Following birth, each newborn baby is carefully examined to assess for signs of problems or complications. Newborn assessment is represented in this picmonic by the newborn assess man. Within one and five minutes of birth, the newborn's heart rate, respiratory rate, muscle tone, reflexes, and skin color are assessed using the APGAR scoring system, illustrated by Virginia APGAR. The umbilical cord, shown literally by the assess man swinging from his umbilical cord, is clamped and cut and a blood sample is collected to assess for a number of factors. The stump of the umbilical cord is checked for two arteries in one vein, shown by the two archery arteries and one vine vein. To protect the newborn from bacterial infections during delivery, eye drops or an ointment containing antibiotic medication is applied to the newborn's eyes within one hour of birth. Newborn eye prophylaxis is represented by the eye with purple axes. The newborn's fontanelles, illustrated by the fountain, are assessed, and an intramuscular vitamin K injection, shown by the Viking King with syringe, is administered, as newborns are unable to synthesize vitamin K until a few weeks after birth. A gestational age assessment, GAA, shown by the GAA score, is performed to measure physical and neuromuscular maturity. This includes taking a birth weight, shown by the weight scale, with the average weight of a newborn infant ranging between 5 pounds 8 ounces and 8 pounds 13 ounces. Other measurements taken of each baby include head circumference, shown by the newborn with a measuring tape around his head, and length, shown by the newborn having his length measured. Length is measured from the crown of the head to the heel. Newborns lack the fat stores to maintain thermoregulation, so after delivery, be sure to keep the newborn warm, shown by the warm fire. This is critical in preventing cold stress leading to complications. Lastly, shortly after delivery, matching ID bands, shown by the ID band the newborn is wearing, are placed on the infant's ankle and parents to maintain identity and prevent abduction. So let's review the components of a newborn assessment. An APGAR score is taken, the umbilical cord is checked for two arteries in one vein, and antibiotic eye prophylaxis is administered. The fontanelles are assessed, intramuscular vitamin K is given, and a gestational age assessment is performed. Newborn measurements include birth weight, head circumference, and body length. Keeping the infant warm is critical since neonates lack sufficient fat stores to maintain temperature, and after birth, an ID band is placed on the infant's ankle and on the parent. Just after birth, every newborn is put through a series of trials to see what they're made of and the newborn assess man came out raring to go. First, he overcame Virginia Apgar's obstacles. For the rest of the story, check out Picmonic.com and sign up for a free account. There, you can also take Picmonic's quiz. The quiz automatically sets up your daily quiz by using space repetition algorithms based on the questions you've missed or struggled with to make sure you study what you need when you need to. And while you're there, check out the rest of our neonatal assessment pathway. We've got a huge amount of the content you need to remember. Everything from APGAR score to newborn assessment and so much more. So see how hundreds of thousands of students like yourself have figured out how to save time and have fun doing it. So you can lock in everything you need to know forever. Play, quiz, and space repetition. Efficient, effective, and research proven to increase exam scores.